So first of all, you have to realize that at the beginning of 2000, there was a blessing that God was beginning to release to the body. Now, the sanctification speaks of the rapture and the rest speaks when we are finally in New Jerusalem. But there is a moment where God literally blesses the church because, again, remember, God cannot come back for a church that does not look like him. Mm -hmm. He has to come back for a church yeah. that literally reflects who he is and the power that he operates in. That is the moment of 2011 because 2010 was 2000 to me, my personal revelation and tithe. It was the year that God tithed back to the body. My God, we've been tithing to him, but now he tithes back to us. If you look up the tithe or even look up your mind, the uh, scientists say that you only use 10% of your brain. Well, 10% is a tithe of your brain. And if we could just get to the place that we tithe our minds back to God, he'll start unlocking the 90. And what we're looking at in 2011 is that we are looking at people uh, that are going to begin to start to operate in the prophet. My God, they're going to operate in the prophetic. They're going to operate in the word of knowledge. They're going to operate, my God, in the gifts of the spirit. We're going to begin to see an influx. And what I believe why God sent me here to uh, Illinois is that we're in the heartland. Mm -hmm. And I believe this is my personal belief that a revival will break out in the heartland or the heart of, the, of America because out of the heart are the issues of life. And so I believe that revival is coming to this area. And I believe that TCT was strategically placed in the heart, my God. God, in the heartland for this reason, that TCT would bring about the revival that is getting ready to shake the nation. Mm. Mm. It is. <laughs> Over to God. Wow, I can't say anything else to that. I tell you, though, we've got the, the bishop here, and, and uh, before this program is out, I think we need to go into some prayer requests because there is a stirring here in, in the studio, and so I encourage you to call the number, 800-232-9855. Call in your prayer requests, but can we go ahead and, and read some prayer requests that have come in? Yeah, we have some from uh, Indonesia, United Kingdom, of course, North Carolina, Michigan, and just somewhere in the United States, we don't know where. I mean, literally all over the world, yes. we're getting wow. these. Um, uh, Ohio, New York, um, and, and of course, the, we have all the different prayer centers yes. that we get these from. But we now this is the reason why we're here. That's right. Oh, God. We got a salvation report. This is uh, Bobby from North Carolina. All right. I want to, uh, I can't even talk. We want to welcome him to the family. Yeah, yeah. We, yeah oh, we're excited. Christmas. Thank you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes, Definitely. Thank you. Definitely. All right. Amen. Bishop, you want to just pray over these? Amen. Amen. Father, in Jesus' name, Lord, I thank you for who you are. Yes, God. I thank you, Father God, that in this season, Lord God, when people are being discouraged by what they don't have, Father, I pray today that you would remind them of what they do yes, have. Yes, God. Father, the greatest gift of all, Jesus Christ. I thank you that no other name, God, men can be saved by. I thank you, Father God, for every prayer request that comes in, Father God, that you touch them. Father God, that, uh, that, you, that your arms are not too short. God, wherever they are, what I love about you, God, is no matter how many prayers are going up all over the world, Father, you hear every one of them every need, God, I pray today in the name of Jesus Christ would be met by your power mm -hmm. and your glory. Yes, Jesus. I pray, Father God, that today that families would gather around yes, Jesus, and they would gather around the family, not the tree, God, but gather around the family and declare that in this season when the world is trying to turn away from families, Lord, God, you would strengthen every family, mm -hmm. that you would cause families to come together that have been arguing all year long. And Father God, let them come together in this season and declare we are a family mm -hmm. and we will not be broken. God bless these people that have sent in this request. Let them know that their prayers have been heard, that the effectual pr fervent prayers of the righteous do avail much. And God, I bless you in advance. In Jesus' name for it, amen. Amen. Glory to God. Wow, mm -hmm. that is awesome. Yes, thank you. Glory to God. We are in the Christmas season. So, uh, you know, we've been enjoying for the last few days on TCT you, Today some Christmas music. And uh, I, uh, is it Bob and Jeannie Johnson that we're going to be watching here? Longtime friends of the, the ministry. They are. 
Come on, ring those bells. There you go. All right. Watch. Hi, we're Bob and Jeannie Johnson, and we just came by to sort of celebrate Christmas. Come on, ring those bells, would you? Everybody likes to take a holiday. Everybody likes to take a rest. Spending time together with the family. Sharing lots of love and happiness. Come on, ring those bells like Christmas tree. Jesus is the king born for you and me. Come on, ring those bells, everybody say, Jesus, we remember this your birthday. Celebrations come because of something good. Celebrations we love to recall. Mary had a baby boy in Bethlehem. Greatest celebration of them all. Come on, ring those bells like the Christmas tree. Jesus is the King, born for you and me. Come on, ring those bells. Everybody say, Jesus, we remember this your birthday. Come on, ring those bells like the Christmas tree. Jesus is the King, born for you and me. Come on, ring those bells, everybody say. Jesus, we remember this your birthday. Come on, ring those bells, like the Christmas tree. Jesus is the King, born for you and me. Come on, ring those bells, everybody say. Jesus, we remember this your birthday. Jesus, we remember this your birthday. Come on, ring those bells. Happy Celebrate birthday, Christmas. Jesus. Light the Christmas tree. Merry Christmas, everyone. <laughs> that was good. That was, that was good. Awesome. I just love that set, too. Uh huh. That's one of my favorite sets I've ever done. But anyway, well, I hope you enjoyed that. And Bishop Coltfield, what's your email or um, website? Do you have one? Spirit of Fire Cathedral, uh, Southern Illinois on Facebook. Um, or you can hit my email, clayc777 at yahoo.com. Amen. <laughs> there you go. So if you're looking at a church home in what town? In Harrisburg, Illinois. We're at the Harrisburg Middle School, uh, Richmond, Virginia. We're on um, 3735 Metal Bridge Road. Okay, good. Yes. Good. That's I'm awesome. glad you were here. <laughs> I'm glad I got to. I, I tried to fix my hair the way you guys had it, but it, you know it really it looks put me good. in the middle, but it didn't fall. I was, I was trying. <laughs> oh, lying. we want to let you know. <laughs> we can set you up in a church uh, with a pastor in a church anywhere you live. Amen. If you don't live where pa Bishop Clay lives, I, I don't know. Where. <laughs> Just call in or write in and let us Lord. know if you don't have a church home. We'll be definitely uh, glad to, to refer you to a church home. Okay. <laughs> i got to keep you two apart. I know. <laughs> so uh, and say hi to Vanessa one more time. Hey, hey, hey Vanessa. Hey, ba hey baby. <laughs> 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 Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>